From a two-meter pig-sized rhinoceros with a pair of side-by-side -side horns on its nose, to a tiny 10-centimeter early placental mammal, let's see how evolution shaped the white rhinoceros. Placental ancestors. Tiny early mammals that gave rise to many later animal groups, including ungulates. Jurassic period. Hyracius eximius, a running rhinoceros that looked like a heavy set taper and lacked a horn. Eocene epoch. Trigonius osborni, one of the earliest members of the rhinoceros family that transitioned to a defensive and bulky build. Early Oligocene. First horned rhino, a pig-sized rhinoceros and one of the first to evolve side-by-side -side horns. Early Miocene. African stem rhino. A heavy-bodied, short-legged rhino that lived in wetter environments. Middle Miocene. Ancestral white rhino, the direct ancestor showing the shift to a square lip specialized for grazing grass. Late Miocene. White rhinoceros, the largest remaining rhino species known for its massive head and social behavior. Now, From a small ancient insectivore to a bulky horned herbivore, this is a fascinating look at how evolution shaped the white rhinoceros. <laughs>